find cos 570 to find this we should follow this method C here we have 570 now you should check 570 lies between which two multiples of 180 what I mean is 570 lies between 540 and 720 this is 180 into 3 and this is 180 into 4 between these two numbers 570 lies next now 570 is close to which number this is close to 540 so 570 now should be written as 540 plus 30 so this will become cos in place of this now we write this 540 plus 30 this is your step 1 next cos in place of 540 now we should write 3 into 180 plus 30 next here we have 180 so cos is not going to change it will remain cos and inside we get this angle 30 now the question is will we get here plus or minus to answer that we should look at the number before 180 that is 3 and 3 is odd and all the odd multiples of 180 they lie in either in the second or in the third quadrant so now to select the quadrant we should look at this symbol here we have plus that means angle lies in the third quadrant and in the third quadrant cos is negative so we should put negative so negative cos 30 is root 3 by 2 this is our answer